Hey, what's going on everyone? Fast Food Toy Reviews here. Today we have Star Wars, set of six wonderful looking toys released by KFC Australia back in 1997. That's right, these toys were released in Australia. Let's get them opened up and have a closer look. First up in the set we have Darth Vader, the greatest villain of all time in the Star Wars movie verse. This is cool. So the gimmick is, with this little button, you give this a push and watch this, you ready? And Darth Vader's head pops open and watch what it reveals, you ready? <laughs> we give it a push. And look at that! It's Anakin Skywalker in there. And it shows Darth Vader without his helmet. So let's open this up and have a look. That is so cool. And it's like ru rubber and it's kind of soft and squishy. And you can see the different details on there. It looks like he's got a boo-boo on the top of his head there. And you can rotate it around, spin it around. And that's it. That's the gimmick. You give this button a push one more time. Come on. There we go. And look at that. <laughs> Very cool. And next up in the set is a sand crawler. So some of you old school Star Wars enthusiasts might remember these from the movies. And maybe, maybe all of you do. Either way, it's a really cool, basic looking toy made of soft like rubber if you will but if you flip it over on this side it's a plastic door and you open it up and inside is come on out of there come on <laughs> a little mini r2d2 figurine look at this look it's a little mini r2 <laughs> how cute is that and that's it you stick him back in here and he goes along for the ride and that's it it's the sand crawler with R2-D2. Very nice. Up next in the set is the Death Star. Yes, this one looks really nice. And on the back here, you have this little lever. You pull this, kind of like a pinball machine, and it's spring-loaded, and that's the gimmick. So you open it up, and inside, you have a little compartment here, and you have six cardboard TIE Fighters. They're cut out like little, little TIE Fighters. And it works best if you just put three in at a time. It came with six. So we'll load up the three right in here. It's like that. You give it a push, close it back down. Then you come back here. Like I said, like a pinball machine. You pull this and let it go. And it shoots little TIE Fighters out of there. We'll do it one more time. Pop this open. There we go. And we'll load them up. One, two, three. And you ready? Here we go. <laughs> so there you go. It's the shooting Death Star. Next up in the set is the AT-80, -AT, the all-terrain armored transport. One of the most iconic things from Star Wars. It's one of the most recognizable machines, if you will, vehicles. Very cool looking. So you can rotate all four legs just like this. And you can kind of position him however you want. Make him look like he's walking along. And you can rotate the head around if you'd like and actually rotates all the way around and that is it but a little bit of a gimmick here on the side is another door you flip this open there we go and inside it reveals a ghost no it's it looks like it's the all just all white maybe a stormtrooper type guy the AT, AT driver if you will and that's it you flow, fold this back up and there you go Looking nice. I love this thing. It's really cool looking. So there you go. It's the AT-80. -AT. Next up we have the spinning TIE Fighter and the X-Wing Star Fighter. So they're made of soft plastic, like a rubber, if you will. And they're kind of warped, which you could probably fix with a blow dryer, some light heat, or maybe if you're willing to risk it, you could probably some hot water and kind of mold these back into place. They look really cool. But you can see it's just sitting in the package too long and this little gun here is kind of warped so what it is there's two other parts here and what you do is you attach this right to the side here there's like a little opening I'll plug this in right there so you get that one there and then same with this on this side and we'll plug it in like this and once it's in there we go it's a shame that's looking all silly boy I'll tell you and then you plop it in top just like that and give it a spin just like that and it's like they're chasing each other around like having a intergalactic star battle 
<laughs> Very cool. I'm gonna have to work on getting those fixed. They look awfully silly, especially the the TIE Fighter. But there it is. It's the TIE Fighter and X-Wing Starfighter spinny toy. <laughs> and last up in the set is the ATST, the All-Terrain Scout Transport. Another iconic piece from the movies, at least the, the movies from way back in the day. Very cool looking toy. It actually came unassembled. You had to plug the legs on. Very simple, just like that. And you got some moving guns on the side. You can rotate them. This one here moves up and down in the front. And you have a latch. Which you could probably put a little mini figure in there if you want. If you got something small enough to put in there, maybe that R2. And the gimmick is, it's really weird. It's, it's, this rotates around here, but you have to hold this in place. And there's a little button on the back. You give this a push and watch this. We're going to hold this in place and watch. I'm going to push the button and <laughs> his legs move back and forth. And that's, that's the gimmick. I thought maybe it was like a little wind-up feature or something in there, and then you release it and he would walk, which would have been too cool. But that's it. That's the gimmick. You just push the button, and it makes it look like he's walking and running, maybe jogging. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> but there you go. The AT-ST. So there you have it, everyone. Star Wars set of six wonderful little toys released by KFC, Kentucky Fried Chicken, back in 1997. And this set was imported from Australia. So it was Australia KFC. A very fun, enjoyable, collectible set for sure. Thanks for watching, everybody. Take care. We'll see you next time.